that, that's a good question. I, I don't know if you uh, realized what I was doing while I was playing, but there's a technique that's called circular breathing, um, and that's that's what you need to learn in order to play uh, the didgeridoo for uh, an extended period of time. Um, and what happens is, is, you know, normally, of course, I'm, I'm going into the didgeridoo and I'm going to run out of breath. Um, at the end of my breath, what I have to do is I, I basically blow my cheeks up with air, uh, and then I'm going to take a quick breath in my nose, and while I do that, I squeeze my cheeks together, and that little bit of air that comes out is enough to keep the didgeridoo going for that split second while I get another breath. Um, and I'll go ahead and demonstrate it so you can see it happening now that I've explained it. So yes, breath breath control is 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 very important. It it, uh, it demands a lot of, of of control. Now it doesn't demand a lot of breath. People uh, mis um, a lot of the times mistaken. They, they think that I'm you know working very hard, but in actuality, I, I'm, it's very calming to play the do and I'm not it's not exhausting. It's, it's actually the opposite. It's, it's energizing. Another question? Okay, uh, that's a good question. Yeah, there's, 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 I mean, literally, the, the didgeridoo in terms of the sounds that it can pr produce is really infinite. Um, you can make as many sounds as there are. Um, but some of the techniques to use to, to change the sound is, are, are my cheeks, my tongue, my throat, my ab, my stomach. Um, so I'm moving my tongue back and forth, or, and I'm also voicing things. I can say things in there, I can hoot and howl. Um, for instance, if I, if I mouth the vowel sounds E, O, E, O while I'm playing, this is what it'll sound like. That's basically how you make the sounds. Now the basic sound, what I'm doing is I'm trying to, I'm vibrating my lips. And, and basically, the didgeridoo is just acting as a natural ampl amplifier. So I'm just going to the didgeridoo. That's my son, he's three, he plays as well. Any other questions? Didgeridoo. I do have a, a new didgeridoo that someone gifted me, and it's actually, it's pretty interesting. It's a, a slide didgeridoo. Wow. And uh, what that allows me to do is, is change the, you know, the key and the pitch and, and actually do a whole another series of crazy didgeridoo things. I'll give you a real quick, short demonstration.